Whenever somebody falls ill, what we wish for them? We tell them, get well soon. So, what is this wellness and why does it matter? We are going to discuss about this in today's video. Hello friends, I am physiotherapist Meghna Dave and this is Health Q channel, the health awareness channel where our mission is to motivate you to look at the brighter side of the health. So, let's begin today's video. is a very important factor of living a good life. So what is wellness? Wellness is nothing but is a process of becoming aware of making choices that is towards healthy and fulfilling life. Wellness enables you to live a life that is balanced, which is fulfilling and which covers all the aspects of aspirations, of emotions, of achievement in your life. If you look at the definition according to WHO or its World Health Organization, wellness is defined as state of complete physical, mental and social well-being, not just merely absence of a disease or infirmity. When it comes to National Institute of Wellness, it has defined wellness as unconscious self-directed and evolving process of achieving full potential. But now the question arises, why wellness matters? Wellness is one of the most important aspect of life that one should ensure or else should aim to achieve at. Wellness enables you to live a higher quality of life. Wellness enables you to keep control or else have control over your emotions and actions. Wellness is also important for you to make sure that you are staying away from stress, anxiety, depression and other mental health issues. Now, when it comes to wellness definition or else you can say there are different dimensions of wellness and basically these dimension of wellness are emotional wellness, environmental wellness, financial wellness, social wellness, physical wellness, spiritual wellness, intellectual wellness and occupational wellness. So friends, let's talk about this eight dimensions of wellness. The main core dimensions of wellness are something if you are able to attain, then you would be able to live a very well balanced lifestyle that not only keeps you healthy, wealthy, wise, but at the same time, you will be always happy, which is the most core emotion that we want from our life. So what are these eight dimensions? Let's have a look. Let's start with the first dimension and that is emotional wellness. Emotional well-being is very important. It enables you to live a life with the sense of being happy at the same time identifying all your emotions and also helps you to deal with the negative emotions that comes in your life. It's your ability to understand your feelings effectively and thus enabling you to come up with the coping strategies towards your feeling. The next dimension of wellness is environmental wellness. Environmental wellness basically stands for your ability to live in harmony with your surroundings. Your surroundings mostly comprises of your people as well as the nature. If you are able to live with harmony with this nature, with the environment, you are able to live in a pretty balanced life. Environmental wellness is your ability to live a lifestyle which is effective to your surrounding and encourages you to interact with your surroundings in a positive manner. Financial well-being. Money is a major and crucial factor in one person's life. Not having enough can lead to the state of sadness, of feeling of lacking behind at the same time also increases the greed in the person. It impacts your life's performance as well. Financial stress is one of the major cause of concern when it comes to emotional and mental health issues like depression, stress and anxiety. Being able to attain a state of financial wellness where you have enough amount of money that enables you to live the life which you want for yourself in order to achieve and gain all the material desires that you have at the same time staying detached with the greed and the sense or its urge of earning more and more money no matter how money is there or as you can say being in the state of abundance that is something that comes with the state of financial wellness the fourth dimension is physical wellness physical wellness stands for living a life that is balanced and healthy and is away from the state of disease or sickness as a human being with the help of exercises balanced diet at the same time practicing of some of the healthy lifestyle habits enable you to attain the state of physical wellness 
physical wellness stands for healthy body and seeking health whenever the body is in a state of sickness moving to the next dimension the fifth dimension and that is social wellness human beings are social animals hence we need to be surrounded by the people and we need to develop an emotional connections with the people social wellness helps you to develop relationship that are positive that are enriching helps you to gain a effective role in the society for yourself that is in alignment with your emotional well-being with your spiritual well-being at the same time your core purpose and core interest in your life it enables you to comfortably build a relationship and a community that supports and nurtures each other and develop a support system that stands with you in your thick and thin this only comes when you have the state of social well-being the next is spiritual wellness spiritual wellness is being able to be aware of your reason or the core purpose of being in existence spiritual wellness once you are able to attain you know what actions you need to take that are in alignment with your core purpose and the life spiritual wellness helps you to attain higher state of consciousness and thus helps you to live a life that is in harmony in peace and is in equilibrium seventh is an intellectual wellness intellectual wellness is being able to be open to new ideas and thus gradually increasing your bank of knowledge this helps you to attain higher level of financial wellness spiritual wellness social wellness environmental wellness and sometimes even the physical wellness and the last dimension is your occupational wellness occupational wellness stands for your ability to enjoy your occupational role enjoy your occupational endeavors and appreciate your role your responsibilities your contributions towards the society it encourages you to build personal satisfaction and an enrichment through your work as you saw all the said dimension of the wellness are interrelated even if you lack one aspect of wellness it might affect the other dimensions of wellness as well hence as a human being we all should thrive to achieve and attain a state of well-being in the all the eight dimensions when you are able to achieve this you will not only have a healthy life a well life but a fulfilling and a happy life which is the core purpose or a core desire of every single human being so if we want to be healthy we should somewhere thrive to develop the state and sense of wellness i hope you like this idea and concept of sharing the state different dimensions of wellness if you have something to add on into this if you have any of your opinions make sure to share those opinions in the comment section below i would love to hear them on that note i'll end this video here make sure to like this video share this video and subscribe to health q channel for more such health awareness video i'll see you on another video till then thank you